It's no doubt that Apple is the cool tech company, but are they beginning to lose their touch? Welcome back to Interest Things. My name is Jack O'Brien. While Apple has always marketed their products as both easy to use and cool, in 2016 and frankly in the past few years, Apple has started to lose their touch as being the cool guys. Apple is still the largest company in the world and isn't going anywhere, but it appears that their oldest friend maybe is giving them a run for their money. That's right, Microsoft is coming back. Microsoft has not been in the limelight much over the past several years except for when it comes to gaming, but it looks like Microsoft just might become the next cool tech company. Microsoft has released some pretty sweet products over the past several years, including the Surface Pro 4 and the Surface Studio, which comes in at a whopping four grand. Apple, on the other hand, has gotten some bad reviews on their newest laptop, which has a cute touch bar instead of a touch screen like the new Microsoft laptop. And this touch bar really wasn't worth losing the backlit Apple logo on your laptop. So yes, Microsoft is throwing everything they have at innovation, while Apple is being very complacent and really hasn't been doing much in the field of innovation. So this means that Apple must be doing bad, right? This is actually quite the opposite, as Apple has been doing very well in the past several years and really isn't going anywhere. As a result, Apple may have created some laptops that were subpar or some phones that look really similar to one another, but the truth is that Apple is still king and these current products are just a result of their number one status. Microsoft, on the other hand, has been throwing Hail Marys in order to find the next breakthrough technology. While everything that Microsoft does is generally open to the public eye, Apple likes to keep things behind closed doors and keep it private. So while we might not be seeing any new breakthrough technology from Apple, as soon as they're ready to reveal it, that's when Microsoft should be scared. Any new breakthroughs that Microsoft comes out with will likely be produced by other companies as well, so it won't just be Microsoft that is benefiting. While 2016 might not have gotten Apple products the best review, 2017 is still predicted to be the year when Apple sales ellipse total Windows sales. This means that more people will be buying and using an Apple device than Windows. So despite what might have happened to Apple in 2016, it doesn't look like the company is going anywhere and Apple seems to be doing just fine. But seriously though, Microsoft, where's that HoloLens? That's what you need. So what do you guys think? Do you think that Apple really is going to still be number one or is Windows gonna start to give them a run for their money? Let me know in the comments down below and don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe for more if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one.